In today's video, we're going to show you how to remove the pump from your top load washer. Uh, our first step, we need to remove the cabinet. And to do that on this machine, it's very easy. We just need a putty knife that we're just going to install between this seam, between the cabinet and the upper console. So that'll allow us to flip the console back so we can get at the clips that hold the cabinet in place. So now we'll just release the catch on the other side. That'll allow the console to flip back. Now this machine also has a lid switch with a wiring harness that we need to unhook just by pressing that tab and pull that harness off. Now I'm just going to take a blade screwdriver, put it down into the latch and unhook it. So now we'll remove the same catch on this side. Again, just putting our blade screwdriver in, prying to the back and release the catch. With that catch removed, we can now remove the cabinet from the machine simply by tipping it forward. And taking it away and set it aside. And the pump's quite easy to remove. Just need to remove these clips. You can just press them with your fingers. With those removed, we now just need to release our clamps with a pair of pliers. Now there's a good chance there may still be water in the pump when you go to do it. I know for this machine there shouldn't be any at this point, but just to be aware, you may want to put a towel down or a couple sponges handy and just pull your hoses off. And then you just slip your pump off your machine. Now on this machine, it's just held by those two clips. There's other machines and other models in which the pump is retained in a different way, but it'll just be just about as straightforward. You just have to locate your pump and see how it's attached. And that's how you remove your pump. Mm -hmm.